Welcome everyone and thank you so much for joining in. As we can see guys, the price of Bitcoin right now is testing one of the most important line of resistance. Resistance from this Williams Alligator Indicator, resistance from this CPI Indicator and along with that even the resistance from this Bollinger Band. So will this resistance get broken once and for all because if we do that, you can see the upcoming scenario for Bitcoin looks very, very bullish. So before I start talking about it, I want you guys to do me a favor and quickly destroy that like button. And to those individuals watching this for the first time to hit that subscribe button. And also a quick reminder, if you haven't claimed this free, 200 USDT futures position airdrop from Bybit then please check the video description because Bybit right now is giving around free position airdrop 200 USDT position airdrop either Bitcoin USDT position Ethereum USDT position or Solana USDT position all the links are in the description down below feel free to check it out feel free to grab this opportunity now if you look at this price action of Bitcoin in a daily time frame you can see guys the price of Bitcoin is testing the resistance from this Williams alligator indicator and on my previous video i showed you guys that during a downtrend whenever we have seen this bearish crossover happening the price of bitcoin always got rejected while trying to break out from this trend line which resulted in a corrective move you can see each and every relief rally resulted in a corrective move because this here was a bearish williams alligator crossover blue line appearing at the top green line at the bottom and you can see it has happened plenty of time whenever we have seen this bearish crossover happening in williams alligator indicator relief rally has ended in a corrective move like this so what i'm trying to pinpoint is that since this year is also a bearish crossover blue line is at the top green line at the bottom this relief rally could be also ending like this i mean price getting rejected around this williams alligator indicator and then slowly head towards this original trend direction but things are changing i mean if you look to the downside you can see guys this airvesa line has now jumped above 50 which is a very very good sign and even the macd which is a bearish macd cross looks like it might be forming a bullish crossover very very soon and along with that even this T3 CCI indicator you can see could be slowly entering in a positive territory. So if we are going to get the confirmation from these two indicators, RSI is already over 50, one confirmation is there. Second confirmation, we have to see MACD turning bullish. I mean a bullish crossover in MACD and this T3 CCI indicator appearing in a positive territory. If we see that happening, then this here will be considered an actual bullish move like this where we could be easily getting attracted around 77 even up to 80,000 before choosing a trend duration and the reason is very simple guys in the past price action whenever we have seen this crossover happening I mean if you look at this carefully RSA line jumping above 50 MACD forming a bullish crossover and this T3 CCI indicated in a positive territory you can see what has happened after that. The price of Bitcoin after that has started a very, very bullish move and it has happened plenty of times. So that's why we need a confirmation from this MACD and T3 CCI indicator if you want to see the price of Bitcoin turning parabolic because we know parallelly, I showed you this inverse head and shoulder type of formation in my previous video. I was very clear breaking the neckline here could be resulting in a bullish move and if you look at it carefully we are over this neckline but we still need a proper confirmation from this indicator to say this is an actual bullish trend but in the medium short term yes it might result in a continuation at least towards 69 70 000 because that's the price opportunity from this inverse head and shoulder right you can see that's the price opportunity from this inverse head and shoulder 70 000 69 000 and parallelly it is also the upper trend line from this descending channel or bull flag i mean in the past price action you can see whenever we have found a proper support at the lower trend line from this bull flag or descending channel it has resulted in an impulsive move each and every retracement around this lower trend line has resulted in a bullish move i told you on my previous video if this year is going to be another continuation then 
this upper trend line is where we could be getting attracted so that's why i showed you in a bigger picture 60,000 was very very important line of support so remaining above that range means we could see some more impulsive move price coming across this 69 70 000 before deciding the actual trend direction because once we break that i mean once we break out from this 70 000 as well then you can see 80 000 will be our next price objective because you can see guys for the media short term if this trend is going to continue further here to the upside this upper trend line looks like attracting us around 70 000 price opportunity from this inverse head and shoulder and even the upper trend line from this descending triangle yes guys this descending triangle is a bearish continuation pattern but even though if this year is going to play out i mean a bearish continuation after some bullish move we are still expecting price of Bitcoin to get attracted around 70,000 before, right, before choosing a trend duration here like this. So what I'm trying to pinpoint is that since the price has already managed to find proper support above 60,000 in the bigger picture, now this might be resulting in some impulsive move price getting attracted around 69, 70,000 before choosing a trend duration. And not just only that, even according to this falling channel descending channel bull flag doesn't matter whatever you call it but in the past price action we have found out breaking out from the previous temporary resistance line has resulted in an impulsive move same thing was unfolding here we broke out of the previous temporary resistance line and now it is resulting in an impulsive move but if you look at this leading indicator carefully you can see the price of bitcoin is finding rejection exactly at the bottom CPI line, which sits around sixty-six thousand three hundred dollar. Yes, guys, this horizontal trend line or the bottom CPI line will be looked as resistance. But in the medium short term, if we can flip this into support, then the central CPI line, even the top CPI line, seventy thousand, is where we could be getting attracted before choosing a trend direction that's why i showed you with this descending triangle the upper trend line might be attracting us around 69,000, 70,000. the upper trend line from the descending channel might be attracting us and even the price opportunity from this inverse head and shoulder might be attracting us so that is another reason why we need the price in the media short term to break out from this trend line once and for all because by doing that we know it is going to result in another continuation here to the upside because parallelly, right, parallelly, the price of Bitcoin in a daily time frame is also facing resistance from this signal line or the basis line. So if this line gets broken, if the price breaks out from this bottom CPI line, then you can see even this Bollinger Band will be supporting this bullish move i mean price in that case could be getting a track around the upper band and we know upper band only gets tested when the price is preparing itself for a new bullish move so if you see a confirmation in this indicator i mean macd turning bullish in a daily time frame and t3 cci jumping in a positive territory there is a very very high probability of this williams alligator indicator also turning bullish like this i mean green line appearing at the top during uptrend blue line at the bottom which will result in further more impulsive move here like this and price in that case could be following this bull flag formation with price objective around eighty thousand, and that is also going to be the new all-time high and now beside this in a smaller time frame even if you look at this price action in a bigger frame i saw a comment saying anoop your ninety thousand target is it still there yes absolutely because even if the price in the media short term shows weakness i have been very clear in a bigger picture we are still bullish bullish because the price has just ended the halving the fourth halving and we are also following this very very interesting formation i mean in the past price action you can see in a monthly time frame whenever the price of bitcoin has broken out from this long-term resistance line this falling turn line which rejected us plenty of time when we flipped that into support found support at the 200 moving average what happened after that the price of bitcoin started with this parabolic move same thing happened here bitcoin was facing resistance around this falling trend line but when we flip that into proper support this falling trend line into proper support you can see the price of bitcoin after that turned very very bullish and now if we look in our case this is in a monthly time frame we have already broken the resistance from this falling trend line and flip that into support now this 
might also be another sign of a continuation i mean continuation to form a new high again because breaking out from the previous high in the past price action you can see it's always resulted in some very very parabolic move and in our case since we have not even started this actual bullish move according to this past price action you can see how bullish the price of bitcoin could be turning in a bigger time frame or for the upcoming months even if we are going to witness some shakeout on our way i don't want you guys to panic because i have been very clear only when this area is aligned to the downside in a monthly time frame was overbought right that was the time when we got the top signal i mean here you can see aries align picked out right it was clearly overbought resulted in a corrective move another scenario here aries align overbought price picked out resulted in a corrective move same thing happened here aries align picked out right overbought resulted in a corrective move but if you look in our case this aries align is still hovering around 70 which means until we see this aries align getting overbought just like from this past price action until then i am actually expecting the price of bitcoin even after some shakeout to still continue with this uptrend so that's why guys if you have any doubt i suggest you simply zoom out so this were some of the quick update that i wanted to share with you in this video if you enjoyed the vlog then please do not hesitate to destroy that like button and to those individuals watching this for the first time to hit that subscribe button and also a friendly reminder to those individuals who have not claimed this free 200 usd futures position airdrop from bybit then i suggest you guys to check the video description because bybit right now is providing around free 200 usd futures position airdrop either bitcoin usd position ethereum usd position or solana usd position all the links are in the description down below feel free to check it out feel free to grab this opportunity and by saying this i'm signing out until next time bye bye